Hello everyone, this is Juan Pla, the personal training supervisor here at the gym in Montvale. And today I want to discuss with you a little bit about nutrition. Now a lot of people tend to get a little too complex about the issue, so I'm going to keep it simple for you before you go on and get a little complex on your own, okay? First thing you need to figure out before you decide if you have to eat carbs or eat protein, fats or anything of the sort, is basically figure out how many calories you actually need in order to maintain your weight, in order to gain weight, in order to lose weight. A lot of people usually put the cart before the horse. And what happens is you never really get anywhere because you really don't understand your energy balance in terms of how much you have to burn and how much you have to actually take in before you get to your weight loss goals. So in the next six weeks, what you want to do before the Memorial Day weekend comes along is you want to really figure out how much you have to take in. That way you can understand how much you have to take out of your diet, okay? So it's not necessarily a game where you want to play where you have to go low carb or anything like that. It doesn't have to be any kind of unnecessary suffering, if you will. You just have to figure out how many calories it actually requires for you to maintain your weight. And then you can probably take out just a few calories just to get things going a little bit. So what I would recommend is for seven straight days, maybe you jot down everything that you've eaten. And like I said, be honest with yourself, write down everything, even caloric beverages. And then that way you can figure out how many calories you're actually taking in on average. And you can start from there. It can easily be a simple thing of taking out about 150 to 200 calories and you can get going there. Rather than doing anything extreme and suffering in the long run, which will eventually have you crash, probably rebound a little bit and gain a little bit more than when you started. So again, this is Juan Pla, personal training supervisor at the gym, telling you to keep it simple, and I'll see you next time.